Hey, it's Rob from Kiss Payments, and today we're going to show you how to uh, adjust or take off the closeout statement uh, on your CloverFlex. So if your CloverFlex uh, at the end of each day when uh, after your closeout time, if it's printing uh, the full closeout report and you'd like it to not do that, you'd rather get your reports directly from the dashboard, uh, we can do that simply uh, right on the CloverFlex. We'll show you how to do that. So first thing you need to do, of course, is turn it on, enter in your passcode uh, in order to get to the uh, admin screen. So on the admin screen, uh, we're going to look for the closeout app. So you can see there it looks like a, almost like a legal symbol, a pillared building. It says close out underneath. So close out. And then under close out, we want to look at the three bars on the left hand side at the top. Click on the three bars and then choose settings. And under settings, you'll see um, auto print totals report on closeout. So if it's unchecked, that means it's not printing. Uh, in order to, of course, stop it from doing that, you simply uncheck. And the auto email totals report on closeout. Uh, if you have that selected, of course, it will email you uh, end of day uh, as well to whatever email is on file. So whichever one of those that uh, you'd like, whatever options, uh, that you don't have to hit save or anything, you can just X out. And then again, you can go here and close those screens. And just let it show up with the X. As soon as you see the X, you can actually close out those screens just like just like a cell phone. All right, and that's as easy as it is. So to turn the closeout report on or off, just go to your closeout tab, uh, settings, and then choose the feature you want.